Sports fan, this is Stephen Hill for JustMyPicks.com, and I bring you a special breaking news bulletin. It's the latest. Steve Smith is done officially as a Carolina Panther, the longtime Carolina Panther wideout. Uh, his agent, Derek Fox, longtime agent, has released a statement saying that Steve Smith is done in Carolina, will not play this season at all, not a single snap. They just don't know how it's going to happen. His contract may be terminated. He may be released. He may be traded to another team. They don't know exactly just yet. Um... This hits hard because growing up, I saw Steve Smith as one of those emotional guys, great little receiver who did a lot of big things in the NFL. You look at helping them get to a Super Bowl. You look at some of the incredible things that Steve Smith has done from punt return, kick return to being a wide receiver and even playing cornerback. A lot of people didn't know that early on in his career when Panthers had injuries, they went through a lot of critical situations. Steve Smith was back there sometimes. And that just goes to show you he was a voice of the Carolina Panthers for so many years. Now the Carolina Panthers are trying to get Cam Newton's voice to be the voice in the locker room. Let him be the leader in 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 Carolina, but he's been forced out. Basically, we're seeing a lot of players like a Jared Allen, Demarcus Ware, uh, Darrell Revis, all these guys that are good players or or was good players, even like a Julius Peppers, uh, are forced out. Um, usually, this is easy for NFL teams to do, but with Steve Smith and the Carolina Panthers and that fan base, they're so close to Steve Smith, they see him like an older brother. They see a lot of those players on that team see him as like a father figure or older brother. It is kind of hard because we're hearing a lot of reports that he burned a lot of bridges inside the Carolina locker room with Ron Riviera in company with certain players that he's gotten to fights with. It's just hard, you know, and, and in all of my years of doing this, this has been one of the hardest things to report because you don't want to see somebody like a Steve Smith, who you have met personally on several occasions, go through this situation like this. But I feel like he can bounce back. I feel like there's a team out there that will need his services, but it will be a small window for Steve Smith. Because he's older, because he's getting up there in age, he can go to a, like a New England. Uh, a Denver or some place that where they already have an established quarterback, they already have an offensive line that's pretty set to go, and plug him in. He's a hard worker. He's a hard blocker. He plays with passion, anger, and intensity each and every play. You see him get emotional after making first down catches or or even after blocking on good plays and bad plays. So, um, Steve Smith, you know, uh, his legacy in Carolina is going to be a great one probably the best wide receiver they've had in their young history and know they haven't been along uh, uh, around a long time but Steve Smith is one of the dynamic players in Carolina Panthers history and was a leader on the field and off the field even with the fiery personality on and off the field still helped Cam Newton and a lot of those guys get a lot of those things done in that short period of time and looking back at the, the years he had with Jake DeLone, an, a phenomenal athlete, will be remembered in Carolina Panthers history as one of the best. So let me know what you guys feel. Do you feel like the Carolina Panthers are wrong for forcing him out? Do you feel like his time's up? Let me know what you guys feel. Um, check me out at JustMyPicks.com with all the breaking news from NFL free agency and NBA and more. Uh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter at JustMyPicksTV. Tweet me. Let me know what you guys feel. Let me know what you like. Let me know what you don't like. And don't forget, most importantly of all, check out my YouTube channel. YouTube backslash JustMyPicksTV. All the archive videos are there. Every single thing that we've been doing each and every week is up on the internet. So, let us know what you feel. Let us know what you like. Leave your comments. Don't forget to share my videos in your sports group so we can debate with you. Thank you very much.